three and a half pounds of flour, one and a half pints of water, six ounces of margarine, six ounces of eggs, And you can see that the dough is not sticky, not sticky to the table, I'm not using any flour. We need to get to the end of our Once the pieces of uh, dough are made in the shape of a, a round ring, they were then put into boiling water. I'm sure my late grandfather, who did come here over a hundred years ago, will forgive me. But at least we're showing that it can be done by an ordinary person at home who's got a Shabbos kettle and uh, knows how to make the dough. They, went take, they were then taken out of the boiler when they slowly rose to the top, placed on a piece of wood, the um, diameter of the bagel once it became a ring, it went into the oven for maybe four or five minutes so that the top of the bagel would be dry. Once the baker making the bagel found that the dough in the oven was dry, he then deftly turned it over and the bagel baked on the oven bottom, giving you a nice golden brown crust on the outside and soft in the middle. This bagel is still very, very hot, but I know, can you see inside it's lovely and fluffy, and if you see on the outside it's very crusty, and you'll hear that when my teeth hit the bagel, you'll hear a crunch. That is a proper, traditional, boiled, baked on the oven bagel in Leeds, which won't be happening for a very, very long time. Thank you. This cream cheese on the bagel, which is still piping hot, is a very, very nice, tasty delicacy. Mmm! Mmm! Beautiful!